All right, we're here at Woodland with the Hawks' three captains, Matt Zaganini, Zach Floyd, and Tom Gendro. Uh, guys, getting ready for another season here, and we'll start with Matt, who's going to be uh, running back and a linebacker for the team. Matt, what can we expect out of this year's Hawks? Obviously, you lost Jack DiBiase, but you return a lot of guys. Uh, yeah, the loss of Jack was big, but we're here to prove that we're our, we're our own team this year. And Zach, uh, you were uh, one of the top linebackers in the league last year, and you guys returned the entire linebacker core. So, what does uh, what does that bring to your defense, especially? Oh, it, it brings experience. Linebackers are leaders of defense. Um, they help stop the run, drop back in the pass, and that's what we need our our defense right now. Uh, uh, experience and leadership. Right. And Tom, you've been starting on the offensive line for a couple of years, also a linebacker. So, uh, what do you see yourself? I've heard a lot of people call you the leader of the offensive line. So, what do you try to do out there? Just trying to uh, direct, you know, what's going on because last year we weren't really experienced up front, but we, everyone's coming back now, so it should be, we should be all right. So. And Matt, I uh, saw that you had some lofty goals set for yourself. You want to run for uh, a couple thousand yards this year. So how do you think uh, how do you think you can accomplish that goal? Well, I got my returning starting line. Big help right there. Uh, working hard every day. Getting better every day. So just got to put the work in. Zach, this defense was one of the best in the league last year, and most of the guys back. The secondary is a little bit new. So what, what can we look for in the secondary with these new guys? Uh, just, you know, a lot of practice. Practice makes perfect. Uh, the more practice we get defending the pass, the better we'll be. And Tom, this team usually, between running the ball and strong defense, it's a team that likes to hit you guys. I mean, you guys like to get physical. Why is that such a mentality for you guys? Well, phys physicality brings, you know, like uh, intimidation. A big factor in high school football is intimidation. So, I like to bring it. And you guys, what are the goals for this year? You came off a playoff season last year. You almost uh, won the Copper and got a chance to play for the NBL title. And it looks like it's probably going to be a pretty wide open league. So what are your goals for this year, Matt? Our goal every year is to win the Copper. Uh, we like that the fact that we got to the playoffs last year. We want to get there again and uh, hopefully go further this year. And Zach, uh, when you look around the league, are there any teams you guys especially looking forward to playing? I mean, you have Sacred Heart first, and then Ansonia, um, and you got some really tough Copper games too. So, what games do you have circled on the calendar? Definitely Sacred Heart, Warrington, uh, Ansonia, and Wolken. And all time. There you go. About half the schedule, so that just shows every game's a big one. So, uh, Tom, at the end of the season, uh, what do you think Woodland will have accomplished? Copper champs, NBL title. Stay well. That's good. Guys, thanks. All right. Excellent. Thank you guys very much.